Hello. <clears throat> Welcome back to Nine Liner Tattoo. So I haven't made a video for about, I'd say, I think it's four, four or five months. Um, I was just unhappy. I was depressed. I was very, I, I just didn't want to stand here and be like, hey, welcome to Nine Liner Tattoo. And the camera stops be like, because that's what I was doing. Um, so I'm, I'm not 100% there, but I'm better, much better. Um, and I'm back. I'm going to try and make videos again. And the same 20 people might still watch them, but you never know. I might reach a thousand subscribers this year. Oh, wouldn't that be a thing? Anyway, I am back. Um, I hope you enjoy the video. There's going to be a few changes, a few bits, a few different things, but please subscribe, hit the notification bell, like, comment, all that sort of business, and uh, I'll see you down the road. All right, enjoy. Peace. Oh, I meant to say, I'll go into that, the four or five month break in another video or further down the road a little bit, do you know what I mean? And I just didn't want the first one back to be this big, blah, here's everything, you know, so. But yes, thank you very much for watching. Peace. Hello. So, in case you hadn't noticed, we're no longer in Edinburgh. Uh, we decided to come away for Christmas. Uh, me and Sarah and the four little dogs. Um, we are currently in Hartlepool. We found a beautiful little uh, cottage by the sea. Oh, you can see it. Hold on two seconds. So, see that grey one there? The white one next to it and the one next to that is where we are. So, if I can maybe try and... We're in that one, there. And uh, yeah, I'll it's show open. you a bit closer after, but this is uh, not a lot of people's idea of Christmas, coming out to a freezing cold place with a pier, and, but for us it's perfect. So uh, yeah, Merry Christmas, motherfucker. Jojo, Jojo, Jojo. Come all the way up, did it? <laughs> no. <laughs> Jojo. Jolene. Jojo. Jojo. Jojo nearly found a seat on life.
relaxing and breathing is uh, the main two things. Yeah. Nice and easy peasy, yeah. and I shall do the rest. <laughs> but I'm ready. Right, buddy. Right, let's just go for it. Here we go. Nice and easy. Here we go. Mm -hmm. ba -da 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 -da. How's that feel? Not too bad. Good. I think this is the place I've had to, you know, like fat to, to help it. Oi! <laughs> <laughs> so I get you. Right, buddy, are we ready? Uh, maybe. <laughs> let's see. Let's see if you're ready or not. Here we go. I've got my hairband again. Mm -hmm. Never mind. Here we go. Is it numb? No. No? <laughs> I don't think so. Usually it goes all red. No, no. And a funny colour. Hey, what the fuck's wrong with you? <laughs> I see your shape now. Oh, I couldn't be bothered today. I wanted to do the tattoos, but I just could not get in my bed. <laughs> Doing that thing where I'm like, I'll have another 20 minutes and then I'll just drive really fast. <laughs> and then my wife's like, weather's bad. And I'm like, oh, I'm up, I'm up. <laughs> fucking hell, man. Kind of be driving really bad and really fast in this shitty fucking weather. At the same time, I know it was bad weather, it also doesn't give you the right to drive at 20 mile an hour on the fucking motorway though. You yeah. cause me crashes that way. I know. People Pisses me just, off, man. They, like, like, they lose how to drive. Aye, I mean, I understand that it's dangerous and you've got to be careful, and that's that's great. I commend people driving at that speed, and it just causes people to want to overtake, which, they, you know, it's just super fucking dangerous, man. People have a lot of road rage as well, so. Oh, aye. Guilty here. Yeah, I'm, I'm guilty of that too. Where do you work again? Uh, I used to work in the prison, but now I work in Tesco Warehouse. Oh, aye. When did you start there? Um, in Tesco. About eight or nine weeks ago. Ah. Were you working there the last time I tattooed you? No. Uh, I, I was just about to start, and the. I think I got the tattoo on whatever day it was, and then it was like the following week I was ah. starting. So why did you leave the prison again? Oh, it was fucking shit. Too much? Uh, I just quite badly run and no support. 
<laughs> How long were you there? <laughs> Three months. Oh wow. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna be there. But there's an Achilles something then. Not just not for a year. No, it's just the last. Did I tell you my last shift? That was the guy that flung the tail at me. No. Aye. He flung a tail at you. Aye. That's not very nice. He, he took a his of it because his tail was no one. Right. Um, so then he decided to go up and his cell, grab it, and then fucking throw it at us. So once we locked up, I was like, see it. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. I remember, like, you could email people for inside, like, to outside, because you didn't have your phone, obviously, with you. Aye. Um, and I emailed my mum, and I was like, I'm done. I was like, see, by 10 o'clock, I'll not have a job. <laughs> <laughs> Not happening. Uh, no. that way. Like, Did you finish your shift? No, no. Did you know? No, no. I literally, I only started at like seven, and then by ten I woke I was out. Wow. Yeah. Enough's enough. Yeah, that was just utter shite. I'll never ever go back into that kind of thing again. Was the money good? Yeah, yeah. You were only eighteen hundred pound a, a month. Shit! For how many hours? Eh, uh, forty. Fucking hell! But you were staying like fourteen hours shifts sometimes, uh, and then you were only getting like two half hour breaks.